Oh yeah. I'm back. Volume two. Shit to be on my mind. Volume two. Shit to be on my mind. Oh yeah. Dose. The dose. You know? It's like the most I could deal with is a woman with two kids, matter of fact. You know what I'm saying? Some of these bitches be like, like Mike, and your ass jumping up high. And shit, you know what I'm saying? Real quick, you know how that go? I'm talking about like, say six kids. You're gonna be like making baby number seven if you're lucky. But I always got these chicks trying to finesse me. What's up with that? You know what I'm saying? I'm the finesse, I got that man. How the fuck you gonna finesse me? You can't finesse me. That's how I feel. I'm one of them niggas. Put me in that category. I do like a lot of motherfuckers, I ain't gonna be tripping, I'm gonna be friendly, but she don't like friendly niggas, so she, baby number seven, some good hood pussy if I do get famous, it's some scary shit, but then I done been hanging my sucker, but there's some bad motherfuckers out here, I had a bitch so bad, she told me to get a car, she had four kids, oh, she see this shit, kiss my ass, I don't know you bitch, first place, I ain't never cussed you out, you don't even know my number, you don't know me, you ain't your three seconds of glory, mm-mm, not with a name in it, not with a real recognition, doses, it's a dose, baby, this shit that be on my mind, okay, why are we talking about women, let's talk about Women be acting like they pregnant by you. Fucking your emotions up. Still in your babies. Men get raped too. You know what I'm saying? Some niggas out here. I might be one of them. I'm not gonna snitch on them. You know what I'm saying? Bitches be raping you for your babies and shit. Multiple occasions, different bitches. Some of these niggas know about this shit. I had a bitch try to stick her finger in my ass. She blacked her eye. I had a bitch that rubbed my asshole. My baby mama. I still felt some type of way. You know what I'm saying? Shit, I want to keep in the closet. Ain't even the motherfucking niggas. Them niggas know we fighting. It's the bitches you keep close. Cause I don't even hang with niggas. I'm so grown. Unless I get an entourage, I ain't on nobody nothing. You know what I'm saying? That shit ain't gonna fly. I don't need to be paying no niggas no homage. You know how I told niggas a long time ago, homage and all that little peon ass niggas. My shit ain't changed. I'm still a boss. Yes, and you fucks with me. I do this. I does it. I'm the king of it. I'm gonna fuck with it. I'm gonna be that one trying to give you the benefit. You know how that go. So fuck with me. Catch me. On my dean. I don't care. Nigga shitting on the throne. Know what I mean? It's that simple. I think I got the throne. They said the throne don't fight anybody. Yeah. You can be Jesus if you want to. I'm trying to still figure out what that means. Do I want to sit on that motherfucker if I get to heaven? And it's empty? I really don't know. Funny. That shit's real. So let me think about some funny shit. Hmm. Do the birds and the animals have good life like a good human being? It's kind of funny how we glorify them. But they be like, fuck you, dead sad, never gave us shit. You know what I'm saying? Have their babies in our yard. I guess we in charge of the world still. We eat a little bit of chicken here and now. So it's like we was like bullshit, throw that shit out the window. And uh, what else? We we cow and shit, we play that shit, slaughter that shit. But you can kill it inhumane. But you're gonna eat the remains, you didn't get a proper burial. You know, vampire fish shit, and you always kill vegetables. So even if you do that, you kill the plant. Did you wait till it died? Did you harvest it? A berry while it was nice and ripe and shit? And it could have been eaten by a real beast or insect and made some honey. You just try to survive off that and some tofu. I'm talking about some shit.
shit you know can't be food. That shit can't be food. I don't know what the fuck they made that out of. But that shit ain't black. I know that. You ain't even gotta see me for that one. You know where I'm coming from. I'm not dark skinned. I'm one of them golden brothers trying to make it. I'm tired of these light skinned jokes like I ain't been finessing the whole time, if you know me. I feel like the ultimate everything. I, I played sports, I ran, I did good, I done beat UFC players, and certain little hand in hand combat military. I done did more sit ups and push ups than most men. And then in a whole lifetime, and I'm only 37 right now. You know what I'm saying? I used to do a thousand push-ups a day sometimes. My back all messed up, cracked up, you know what I'm saying? Military, disabled veteran. Shit, oh yeah, I got that boom, some way shit going on. I'm trying to get paid. Yeah, mm-hmm. Push it. <laughs> but salute to those who have served. That's most of my friends. You know what I'm saying? We used to crack jokes all day. That's all I do. No break here back then. It was chill. I don't know why I wanted to get out. I forgot that I wasn't making no damn money. I was knowing I was smart, but I forgot that we was damn racist. And I was supporting a damn man. Yeah, I said the powers to be. Uh, I thought it was going to be me. How goofy can you be? You know, it's like poetry. And that's all I need to be a lawyer on the first degree, at least an associate level. Whatever you want to call it, you know what I'm saying? I'm moving up to him in there. You know, greatness. I think I got potential. Shit, who don't? I make your ass see something. I believe something. Believe in something else at the same time. You know how it is? Because once you lose a second, you lose a second. So if you friends, if your friends are here, do forget something and you friends with them then how the fuck could you ever be on point your team messed up y'all sloppy y'all don't know how to go and get it you'll never be nothing that ain't business so I choose who I keep close cause that's company it's like how many times or something start getting too friendly with people they hit you with their situations, what they need, they be thirsty on you, acting like, bam, I can do this and call you anytime, I can talk to you and put this in your life too, I don't need that, believe that, and when it come to it, you can tell, yeah, look at their shoes, that's what I say, I'm a fashion girl, look at their shoes, you looking at their shoes, like, nah, and that's why I might have missed a few, man. I remember my mom and kept me in some Nikes and clean shit, but I did want through Jordan. Yeah, everybody, niggas killed over them. Nike ain't helping nobody. I'm the next nigga to say, shit, we come from somewhere where they discriminated against us. He from my hood, you know what I'm saying? My nigga the wood. They discriminated against us for him to get in if he wasn't smart. Shit, it's been like that. My fuck was born with us. You know what I'm saying? Not that, it's them six foot niggas, just regular old niggas hooping, threes all day, handles all day, steals all day, quick feet, still got jumping ability, get it in the basket, leave the niggas, you ain't got a foul, fight that ass back too, I'm pretty sure you have to deal with that too, dealing with money, you might have been a good guy, anyway, next move up, you do, you know, he got an attitude, you know? It is. But uh, I ain't got nothing against nobody. I ain't discriminating against nobody. I ain't got no problems with nobody. I'm a peaceful guy. I'm laid back and just to it. I'm happy with what I do. I know I'm going to be laying down that thunder.
I didn't need any alcohol again. Fuck that, I got problems. I don't handle my problems like that. I pay my bills. I keep motherfuckers on my issues. I'm private. I'm grown. That's what I want first and foremost. Like I say, I had one of the criminal background check. But motherfuckers was fucking with me in there. And there's no evidence against that. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get my own shit exposed. Got aviation management, business management, stuff like that behind me. You see me, I'm pretty proud of being a college cat. Wait and stay in a newspaper my whole life. Athlete, academics, crime. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> I get anxiety attacks. I don't like sharing something. Volume 2, it's all love, baby, JCR, Volume 2, check me out.